Hey what's up guys, so the most awaited battery test is finally here between the iPhone 6s, iPhone 7, iPhone 8, 7 plus and 8 plus in 2021. As we know that these iPhone models are almost 4 years old but most of you guys were asking about the battery timing of these smartphones so in this video we are going to find out that. Now before starting the test you can see the brightness is set to almost 80% and let me show you the battery health so you can see we have 79% on iPhone 6s, 80% on iPhone 7, 78% on iPhone 8, 82% on 7 plus and 8 plus and as well as all of them are running on their updated software which is the iOS 15.0.2 so now I'm gonna watch some videos on YouTube for just one hour and after that I will show you how much battery they have drain so enjoy the music and we'll be right back. Okay, so after one hour of watching videos on YouTube, we have 73% on 6s, 78% on 7, 64% on 8, 81% on 7 plus and 90% on 8 plus. As you can see the iPhone 6s, 7 and 8 is not doing so well and I am really not happy with such battery timing but now let's play PUBG game for the next 2 hours. So let's see what's going to happen in a couple of minutes. Okay, so it's been 3 hours of this battery drain test and you can see the iPhone 6s 7 is no more in the test but the battle is still continue between the iPhone 8, 7 plus and 8 plus. Now I am gonna do browsing for the next 1 hour so let's see who is next to die. We are back after another 1 hour of browsing, now after a total of 4 hours 7 plus is about to die as well and we have still 5% left on 8 plus. Now it's time to do video recording for the next 1 hour and I hope this is gonna be the last hour for both smartphones. Welcome back, so it was the battery live train test of the all iPhone members in 2021 after the iOS 15.0.2 and as you can see the battery timing of all of them as I have did many activities which usually we do on our smartphones. Now according to this test the iPhone 6s, 7 and 8 are not recommended in 2021 because the battery timing would be such a big problem for you even if you change its battery it's not gonna help you a lot. The iPhone 7 Plus is also not so good in my opinion, I will not recommend it as well. But if we talk about the 8 Plus, so it is still performing better and you can consider this in 2021. But before purchasing the iPhone 8 Plus, the battery health should not be less than 85% if you really want some good battery timing. Ok so it was all about the iOS 15.0.2 battery life test. If this video has helped you to choose between them then I deserve a single subscribe and like. I will really really appreciate that. Also if you guys have got any question feel free to ask me in the comment section below. Thanks for watching and keep supporting us.